That's kind of why she would go here. Mm. God damn, Manica. <laughs> Mm. Oh, I've, that's she's from wise. I... And a drow. That, that's debatable. Yeah. That's debatable. The whole wisdom thing. <laughs> she's probably wiser than her brother. Hmm. She knows mm. not to mess mess with uh, I guess. Well, uh, crawling over the wall here, no looking over the whole thing. She can see that there seems to be something behind the waterfall. Oh, there's there's an really? opening. Make the lizard crawl down a little bit more mm -hmm. and take a look in. Well, the water is like pouring over the entrance. Oh, of the hole, oh so. down there. Yeah, I thought, <laughs> yeah, I thought you made so a sight like the whole She's going to stick her head in the waterfall. <laughs> I'm like, oh, are all right. you kidding yeah. me? Well, she can crawl down and sit here on the ground. <laughs> oh my god, I would have loved that. She's like perched on the seat there. She just peers her head and just gets rushed off the, mm. the lizard. <laughs> what <laughs> is <laughs> this? <laughs> Should have moved the lizard over here so we could look at the tears. All right. Uh, yeah. Meanwhile, Sin has fastened the rope. Then we'll climb down. All right. Do you want a climb check? Well, can it, can you fail a ten? No, no. A, a ten? Uh, no. Then you are good to go. Okay. Just okay. Uh, I'm gonna fail. No! Yay! Believe oh, in yourself. Trust me. Exactly. You got to touch! Uh, Sakari got a. Cl he's a perfect climber. He can just. No. Oh, it's a perfect climber. Wow. Yes. Mm. A DDS just silently just climbs down, saying nothing. I, I, I wasn't just speaking, my mic was muted. As I figured, you know, that's why I brought it up. Yeah, I can't fail the check, though. Ah! Well, she, she, she doesn't better. fall. Yeah, she just doesn't but, make but any they, progress. They use our climbers' kits. Oh, Ivy is right, having, uh, having uh, trouble going down there, but uh, she'll certainly try again. Much better. Shell has a base of seven. She takes ten, gets a seventeen. <laughs> Real Ned will be the last. He'll put his crossbow away. He has a base of two. Taking ten gives him a twelve. You are down. People taking their time. <laughs> doing stuff. Just rushing forward. You know, the lizard taps. He'll make sure to uh, get the rope for Zen. You know, he was there. He was the last person. You can detach yeah, such sure. things. Also, it froze up a little bit. That's all it does. <laughs> it's like not really Ugh. a creature. It's eating too much of the fish. Well, that's just what it does. Yeah, guys, I don't think you hop straight down off the ledge like that. I think there's a staircase here that you follow that gets you to the ground floor. You can certainly like climb down that ledge too if you like, I but mean, yes, there is I, a. I, I didn't, I didn't know what the elevation difference was, but I saw the staircase there, and I kind of figured, you know, mm. maybe, that, maybe, maybe that's the path you take. <laughs> Just throwing that out there. <laughs> I could be wrong. Tough crowd this morning, or this afternoon, this evening. You people mm. need to be more talkative. Uh, Ellen we'll be more told when we want to be more told. We'll point out that uh, that you did see something. It seemed like there was something behind the waterfall. <laughs> if someone is uh, confident in their swimming abilities. Uh, let's see if I'm confident. No, I'm not. Uh, what's your bonus then? Plus seven. Plus seven. It, is that well? We, with my armor check penalty, I I have um, plus six. So. Oh well. I mean, take ten. <laughs> Can we take ten swimming through a know. waterfall? I don't know for a waterfall. But oh, well, I mean, looking at the water, uh, it doesn't. It, it is very rapid, but it doesn't. I mean, it's not that wide. Um, 
Shouldn't be too hard, you were guessing? Well, so you just dive straight in. I'm not diving <laughs> straight doesn't... in, for fuck's sakes, you know. Wait. It's like the edge of a waterfall. You peer behind it. I took off the armor. It's it's not like this rushing rapid of, of like, this Zvirf Neblin chasm death. Mm -hmm. Huh? Well, uh, Rillant leans over and that's looks. That's right. With well, Neri doesn't with, want to get with his wet. his eyes, his incredible eyes that see everything. What does the Alvin eye see? I blackness and he doesn't have a hood hmm well uh, peering in behind a waterfall it's he, he sees a small cave it is littered with uh, bones of well unknowable source at this range um it seems also to have gathered not really dust but you know it doesn't seem to really that anything or anyone has been here in a while hmm Acrobatics check, perhaps? Like, balance on perhaps like some slippery rock to get back there? Sure. Okay. I'll go ahead and select ye old token here for acrobatics. Can I take ten on it? Uh, yeah, you have, um, you have time. Like, it's, time's not what's needed. It, it doesn't take <laughs> any longer than a take twenty does. In that case, that's a, it's a, I, I have a nineteen on acrobatics. All right. You make it inside. Right. In that case, uh, Rillanid, you know, sticks like his stone face, you know, in through the waterfall and into the mist, and then vanishes. <laughs> Has a party. Mm. No, one, no one's invited. Woo! You know, <laughs> then, we'll probably, <laughs> then we'll probably take out his bow just in case the next yeah. thing that comes out of that waterfall is not Rillanid. <laughs> but wearing his skin. That's right. So Breeding the case bear shapeshifter. This was where the double ganger to go at. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you have to resist and all that. Mm. All right. uh, yes, bones, a collection of rocks, uh, lichen covering the walls, a lot of moisture in here, sort of making the whole cave damp, uh, a lot of refuse. Mm. That doesn't sound very exciting. And no, no one stirred it in a while, huh? Doesn't seem like it. So. Any sort of supplies or any sort of, like, markings that would give, like, some sort of purpose? Like a hidden supply cache, or...? Oh, you, uh, make a perception check as you look over the, the interior of the cave. Sure, I can do that. Let's see, what is the perception? Oh, my perception. Eh, I thought so. I'll go ahead and make a roll. Eh, having an off day. Alright. Well... Uh, really goes over the cave. Uh, no, it doesn't really seem to be anything, any supplies or anything in the cave. Um, while rummaging around, though, he does find uh, on the on the back wall here a small drow rune inscribed, um, like cut into the uh, the rock face. Uh, it is a a rune often used in military campaigns. Basically signifying that, yes, this might very well have been some sort of supply cache at one point. Have been, and is not anymore. Well, hmm. there's no supplies here. Hmm. Interesting that one would be used to the southern entrance. Perhaps uh, that was back when Teresia cared more for Vathos than it does now. Yes. Uh, the tracks that are here are very old. They don't seem to be humanoid. Okay. Uh, what about the bones? A knowledge nature, knowledge dungeoneering? Uh, you can go with either. Pick one. I'll pick dungeoneering. I like knowledge dungeoneering. 21? That's actually mm. a 10 for me. <laughs> uh, the, uh, the bones are a haphazard collection of all manner of, you know, underdark critters. Okay. Um, seems like small animals, mostly. Right. There, there isn't there isn't really like you know rabbits or anything down here, but more like you know rodents or vermin of some description. Okay. So a predator of some kind built a lair there. Or perhaps you know really it's, it's been exciting. you know it's been used to uh, the scorpions had to have come from somewhere. Really, it's thinking uh, he was hoping that maybe he could have found their lair back here, but uh, that might be on the other side. Okay. Nope. Oh. No one's been here in a while. Rillanid will, uh, after, you know, taking his minute or two, poke his head out, you know, of the mist. 
you know, drapes, you know, his long flowing locks matted <laughs> <laughs> the waterfall to sort of press them away with a gloved hand and uh and shout over the the den at, at rain nothing more than an empty supply cache once used now filled with refuse very well brother assume you're coming back then no, I'm staying here forever. <laughs> I am becoming a hermit. Rillin it gives serious consideration to Rico's question, then offers a yes. <laughs> Being behind the know. waterfall would be more peaceful than, than his <laughs> life right now, so you know. there, there was there was a serious consideration. <laughs> He took the question for what how it was offered, and uh, he gave a serious answer. <laughs> took his oh, armor, you know. He's got like this rakish, you know, V-neck shirt, you know, just glistening <laughs> obsidian skin. <laughs> you know, strides out of the waterfall. <laughs> and then we'll go back to making sure that everyone is not just suddenly dying to. Cave bears. I'm, I'm not sure why Zinn is exactly cave bears, but yeah. Cave bears. I don't think he has ever seen a bear. As well. Mushroom bears, yes. Mushroom bears, yeah, fungal bears. Um, yeah, well, they, they do emit a soft, eerie glow. Uh, other than that, it's very quiet here. Unusually quiet? Well, uh, I guess Zinn couldn't really tell since he has the, the waterfall oh. kind of. Kind of, it kind of blocks out a lot of sound. Um, but yeah, when standing around here, you know, you're you're waiting for uh, for Rillian to make his way over and back. Yeah. Look, uh, looking does. around, uh, Rain actually notices something. Do I? Yes. It seems like uh, this wall, like by the stairs here, um, roughly fifty feet up, you see a um, a small cave entrance. Rain will. Mm. Yeah, he'll, he's looking around, looks up there. You notice know, the expression change for a moment. Rillanid. Up there. So it seems to be some kind of cave entrance. Rillanid will rotate his head, looking towards it, and says, Yes, the scorpions had to come from somewhere. I thought it might have been from behind the waterfall, but they had to have made their lair at some point. Here seems an ideal location. If there is any traffic, they would have accosted those who wish to come through. Um, how steep is it? it it's, I mean, it's a sheer wall. So... So, as steep as it gets. Hmm. How high up? 50 feet. 50 feet. I you have a grappling arrow. I could probably shoot a rope up there. Oh, well, Mary could take a look. Yeah, you can definitely take a look. Go for oh, it. Oh, that, yeah. <laughs> Gecko. Crawl up the wall. Gecko no, hisses. Peek, peek inside. Yep, another, another peek inside. Another but, uh, waterfall. <laughs> 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 Uh, right. Uh, Alunar peeks inside. He's not confident enough to just crawl in there. Oh, it's just empty. Nope. Oh, baby scorpions. She yes. Will, uh, 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 peeking in, it seems that this is indeed the scorpion hideout. Um, there is a clutch of like glistening black eggs. In a corner, and there seems to be a, a collection of small cave scorpions sort of crawling about in here. Uh, they seem rather feeble, and uh, when uh, a lunar sort of you know peeks in, you know the the closest one sort of you know turns to her direction and sort of raises its small claws. She'll couple down. Uh, it seems that this is their lair. They have both eggs and young in here. Do any Real. would any of this be valuable? Real Ned says 
Not unless anyone here wishes to take one of them, perhaps as a companion of or pet of some kind, maybe operate as a surrogate parent. It could be useful, but we're not going back to Fastival at any time, and I'm not quite sure how well all of them would keep. Well, in the so just... Sorry, Sorry, just for the entire time he was saying that his eyes were just like rotating more and more towards Tristan. <laughs> the eyes. <idea. laughs> <laughs> Neri looks at him and says, uh, "The young still seem uh, willing to sting. I'm not sure it's really worth it. If they are not worth anything, I'm sure they're not unique in here. Others can be found at a more convenient can... time." We Tristan. can probably find the same ones again once we come back. Tristan has a very good handle animal. Sure. You know, if you I want a to. scorpion. Yeah, yeah, but like, yeah, yeah, Tina. If like you you want to attempt to try to handle it out of character, go for it. You're just gonna have to use a rope and make your Aren't way up. Aren't vermin feet. though? They are vermin. Can They're I use you to tame vermin? Well, I mean, with a hand on the animal, you can at least pick one up and, like, you know. Yeah. And you know, then what? <laughs> and, for, and for, like, a series exactly. of. You can, like, train it with food and stuff like that. It's, you know, no. it's not completely mindless. It's a living being, and you can make it work for you, do things. Yep. Keep oh, it as well, a treasured pet. Gonna, well, obviously not Elinary. It's gonna just crawl down again. Nothing of valuable in there, as far as I could see. Trishan looks, I could try to train one of them. Uh, calls. Except the steam says, As your sister. It is, of course, up to you. I need well, help getting up there. Looking at the steam calls, oh. Well, I'm sure Zin can shoot a rope up. I'm sure Zin can, and he will. Out of character? What a bitch. <laughs> Uh, in character, I, I have this climbing riding gecko, but yeah, oh, you can you can not up. try it. Oh, that's not what she asked. Which is important, but that's what I was thinking. <laughs> we're evil. <laughs> so polite. Everyone. We're, we're we're also each other's siblings who have been stuck with each other for 129 years. <laughs> I mean, if you know, Tristan hasn't asked Eleanor if she can. Um, I doubt Tristan would ask. What's the range increment of your grappling arrow? Uh, it's 30 feet. Okay, you have a better range increment than I do then. Well, if this fails, she will ask her. Well, it won't fail. Then it's okay. quite certain that he bought this grappling arrow for a reason. So you can hit a DC 5. I, I can hit the DC 5, yes. Oh, so I will really tie fair. my silk rope to the grappling arrow and shoot it up there. Hopefully. Well, do you have a 1 in 20 chance of missing? <laughs> yes. Let, let's make an attack over here. Just... That's not a 1. Okay. Oh, the grappling arrow grapples. Hooray. Um, uh, I'll lend Trislin uh, my climbers kit to help her up. <laughs> this ha mountain expedition. It gives you a plus 2 bonus. Oh. Yes. Lovely. So... Thank no, seriously, thank you. So make a climb check with a plus two. Oh! Mm. That, Should that, be enough is, for a rope? rope is DC five. Uh, oh, why would it be a DC five? It's As a rope next, against to, walls. next to a wall, yeah. Oh, okay. walls? Multiple? Yeah, like if you're yeah. in a corner. You can oh, that. okay. Yeah, it's uh, you need a ten at least to get up there. In that case, it's yeah. a failure by five or more. She falls from whatever height she attained, which was nothing. <laughs> <laughs> yep, she just couldn't start. Oh, she looks... At Elenary, I'm not strong enough. Can I use your riding gecko? Well, sir, I'm nothing if not generous. She looks at Sen. I'll, the gecko. I'll bring back your arrow. Yes, please. Gecko sort of froze up a little. <laughs> <laughs> can I come on top of it? Yeah, you, you, can, you. you can get up there. This gecko handles like an elevator. Transferring <laughs> up. Ding! Well, just don't get her up. Stick the arrow and walk in. Yep. And Larry considers for a second calling it back, but that would just, uh, yeah. <laughs> no, you're not going to be that obvious. He's been trained to be polite. 
If she did that, Tristan would throw a scorpion in her face. <laughs> Take this! She's confident Tristan would not hit. And you know, Tristan only asked for help up, not down. <laughs> exactly. Also, the same jump. <laughs> All right, looking into the cave, Tristan does indeed see the uh, the baby scorpions, and they uh, they look at her, <laughs> with gleamy little eyes, and seem very hungry, and they raise their stingers. Uh huh. I have no idea what a scorpion eats. Uh, Usually, food, probably. Yeah, Us. like things it uh, can catch. Here's a cave lizard. <laughs> so, and, uh, well, I was thinking of giving it some food before sticking my hand in its face. That uh, seems reasonable. Uh, she will give it some uh, ration. A ration? Okay. Yeah, not some a fish. whole. It's 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 a tiny. You get a little piece. Oh, I guess a little piece of fish. <laughs> the, these scorpions are like as big as ivy. I, I, <laughs> you, you, you might want to give them. They're <laughs> smaller than ivy, a, I think. I, I don't think the scorpions like mushroom cake. <laughs> no, it's, it's fish. Vegetarian. They're, they're tiny, aren't they? They're tiny. See, that's tiny. tiny. They're, they're tiny. Yeah, that, that, they are still pretty big for a scorpion. That is, that's like a cat-sized thing. Cat scorpion. Mm. All right. Oh, it's well. gonna be her cat then. You can make a handle animal check. Can I take ten? Um, you, no. You might be threatened here. <laughs> that's mean. I'm Twenty-seven. Well, yes. This <laughs> cave scorpion it's here just like is the like a scorpion. It's just like she, it like cuddles up to uh, to Tristan and like lowers the stinger and like nibbles happily at the fish. Tristan, cool. Take that as a you can carry me and you pick. Yep, uh, I've given you a control of a young cave scorpion. One. Yep, you got that one. Thank you. I, I always wanted a pet scorpion. Or well, in your backpack. <laughs> It's like she's going to a pen of puppies, like she's like the first one who who's brave enough to approach her and like yep. takes it. <laughs> oh. Let's go, let's go. Leaves it its sibling to die from hunger. I, 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 I can't I'm, bring okay. all of them. That's <laughs> backpack. She, she's a summoner. She has enough things to control. <laughs> don't need Seriously, to give her, like... you want me to take more? No, I don't want anything. <laughs> All the scorpions become the scorpion overlord. I mean, there is always the thought, like the question of Alamai is like, yeah, you know, we could we could make the the gnomes ride these when they grow up. Well, well you know, <laughs> she discards that thought. Rilanid has definitely been like surveying over the jungle, casting frequent glances back to the cave. You know, a little concerned about the fact that they. The mentally fragile sister just went in there to try to tame scorpions, but fucking sure than shit, she comes out with one. <laughs> oh, there you go. Like, like, <laughs> cooing uh, softly dots, over it, petting it. That's a little surprised, and, uh, you know, that's actually a little impressive. The scorpion looks fairly good. Oh, yeah, it sits on Sakari, of course. Of course. <laughs> Grimith, that, that's what happens every time I play a game. I always get. Thousands of pets. Yeah, I wonder why. You know, you, you know, you know. I did offer the suggestion, like because of your proclivities. I didn't expect you to crush the handle animal chip. <laughs> I did. It has been frogs and scorpion. I don't know. Yeah, it's a bit of a long list at this point. Frogs. Tristan just deers, walks up to an animal, says, horses. "You love me now," and it does. Yeah. yeah. Oh yes, I do. I, 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 now I finally realize. The scorpion will never betray you. It's not smart enough to do that. Exactly. Well, I think with Tia, we we were thinking of making a, a grove for her because she had so many pets. <laughs> she was the one who had a frog. True. Sure. All right. Very insulting frog. Yeah, it was very posh. It was. Well, in that case, it's uh, now that we're some distance from the. Wonderful, it's time to unfurl the map, and uh, I suppose we will uh, head up along north of us, along the western bank. I will be right back when you plot a course. Okay. You mean 1216? Yeah, I suppose we should head for 1216, just to like follow a coastline, so we have some semblance of landmark. Yeah. Well, we uh, can probably follow the river here, it's going to... It has to come from somewhere, and I think it's likely it's coming from the lake. It's coming it, from the waterfall. Or it's going it's a, to the lake, rather. I was going to say, it's, it's coming from the waterfall, which is the wall, which is 
water dripping in from the massive overgrowth of forest above us that we don't know about. Uh, that's where it's going from. We can we can follow it, you know, follow it the estuary. But uh, you know, obviously we want some sort of landmark. Otherwise, we could completely get lost here in the state of New Hampshire. I don't want to get lost well, in the know, state of New Hampshire. Zen did bring a map maker's kit, so he's yeah. going to make extensive use of that. Yes, you can edit the map and add things. Yep, you're the official map mapper now. Paint a little waterfall. And yeah, yeah. The, 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 painted a little waterfall, a bunch of happy trees. <laughs> happy scorpions. Well, Larry has tons of paper if you need to to like write notes. That's right. For for what See. we found here. See. I was gonna book. I was gonna make labels like I, I did earlier for like the the amount of time we took to travel here, but you know what? Since you volunteer with your map makers kit, you totally got this under control. So the plan is then that we travel to. Uh, to the, the lake, and then we go south around it? Or we want to go I, north? I, I think we should go north around it. Alright. I, I, sure. I figure, you know, we're going to encounter the Zan at some point anyway. We might as well get that out of the way, right? My guess would be that the Zan are, yeah, somewhere in here. So, uh, uh, he... Because if they're not, then they would be very close to the uh, the, the head of the Skizral. I don't think that's very Checking about the old map, Zan Lair was somewhere around the western bank. Eastern bank was the Skisral hunting grounds. The south was the southern haunted mountain, the beasts of the mountain. I don't exactly feel like going Let there. Let us not right go now. there. <laughs> we can maybe that... hit that up on the return trip, you know? I'll, I'll be right back. Okay. I guess I'll get something to drink as well. Five minute break. Woo!